honors for decades in the family. It, 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 it takes a special place to raise these dogs. That is where they're from. And you can imagine the excitement building in the team right now. Look at the dogs. They're ready to go. The musher's ready to go. And we're going to be going in just a few moments. But this is where you all are going to come in. Because if you're not familiar with what we're going to do, we're going to start counting them down just when we get to 7 o'clock. So we're going to need you all to count down with us just for leading up to 7 o'clock as these teams are getting ready to go. So we're going to do the race. We're going to do the dogs in two-minute intervals. Two-minute intervals. So we'll have a chance for everybody to uh, get uh, a countdown in and make some noise. I know you're down there. Let's hear you make some noise right now. Come on, let's get excited for the start of the race. Ring the bells. Clap your hands. Cheer a little bit. It's the 25th anniversary UP200 in downtown Marquette. Absolutely, and, and Odin, I know that right now he's just loving that. He gets to be the first one to lay some scent down on that trail. His dogs, notice him right now with his lead dog. There's a communication going on there like, like none other. And his dogs know this trail. He has run the UP200, done very well. And of course, it's very similar landscape. These dogs know what it feels like to have the bite of the wind off the lake. That's right, and they may be feeling some through the course of this weekend, but as we said earlier, the safety of the dogs, the safety of the teams, the safety of the mushers are the utmost. So for updates throughout the course of the weekend, for the UP200, the Midnight Run, go to the website. It's up200.org. I know there's going to be a live stream of the Hiawatha Land Amateur Radio Association and their coverage of the race. There's also GPS tracking of the sled dog teams, and all the information will be updated with regularly at the website up200.org so make sure you follow the race there if you have any questions you're worried about the weather tomorrow you're worried about the status of the mush bus well it's a sled dog race it's going to have to be a lot of snow for them to stop anything i'll tell you that much you bet. I noticed that the DNR posted today that there weren't any, some activities were being canceled because it was too cold. How to celebrate winter. You don't cancel anything because it's too cold. You just figure out how to dress better for it. And these dogs like it cold, by the way, ladies and gentlemen. They really do. This is the perfect temperature or even colder for a sled dog race. It's wonderful for them because they are marathon athletes and they are going to get cooking. We are less than two minutes away from the start of the race, so start getting those bells ringing. Start making a little bit of noise. We're going to do the countdown here in just a little bit. It is the 25th anniversary of the UP200, 26th running 25th anniversary. But, you know, who's counting when you're amongst friends? It is a great night for a, a sled dog race, a great night for a kickoff. Beautiful weather that we want right now. We're going to start doing the countdown in just a little bit. We thank all of the volunteers who make this happen. We thank all of the, uh, the sponsors that bring us together. We thank the city of Marquette. We thank Marquette County, Alger County, all of the businesses. But without further ado, we're going to start getting going here. Our first musher out again is Odin Jorgensen from Grand Marais, Minnesota with a sled banner from the pet stop. Frida, you feel the excitement? One minute, Odin. It's time. It's time for him to get to those runners. And he is ready. His last talk with his leaders there. Getting them ready to go. Ladies and gentlemen, pay attention to this communication and what this bond is all about because that's why this musher will not be sleeping for the next couple of days, that's for sure, and those dogs will perform for him like none other. 30 seconds in. As we get close to 10 seconds uh, to the top of the hour, we're going to do a 10 countdown, so get ready for that. We're just about ready to launch our first musher out of the gate for the 25th anniversary UP200. Start making some noise out there and let's get ready to count down. Make some noise. Here we go. Ready? In 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, one. Right. There he goes, Odin Jorgensen from Grand Marais, Minnesota. And we are underway with the 25th anniversary UP200. Our next sled is 